Hello beautiful friends all over the world. I hope you're having a very good day and I also hope you had a very nice morning. Ever since I changed my morning routine like a year ago, I have had way more productive and I think even happier and more positive days than before. I can feel pretty low and uh, low in my energy because the majority of the time in Holland it rains and it's gray. Ever since I changed my morning routine and added some healthy habits, it really changed my mindset all over the day. It can definitely help with having less stress and just having a more productive day. So I hope you're ready. These are my habits that I try to do in the morning. First and foremost, try to get rid of your smartphone in the bedroom. This will definitely change how you're sleeping in general, but also how you wake up because you're not grabbing your phone immediately when you're waking up and it will just set your mind a little bit more free. Another morning habit that is truly very necessary and I think is very, very hard for all of us is at least not to check your phone, but at least definitely not check your email for a whole hour. So when you're waking up, having a shower, having breakfast, just be in well, your own mode and try to wake up and do healthy stuff, make healthy breakfast, do the other habits that I'm about to tell you, but don't check your email. It's very important to actually not check Facebook or Instagram as well, because you'll probably notice that you're getting a little bit of a hectic feeling when you're checking your social media and especially all of the time. So really try to ignore all of these things. And I know it's hard, truly, I of all people know, but you will notice the difference of how calm you are and again, how productive you are during the day as well. When I get up, I immediately go and meditate. So I know that a lot of people wanna drink water first, but I don't meditate if I don't do it right away. So what I do is basically just sit straight in the bed and go and meditate. Now, how long I meditate depends on how busy I am in the morning. Uh, I truly like it to meditate for 15 minutes, but that is quite long. And even five minutes during the day when I'm having a hectic morning can be long as well. But those five minutes will truly help you with your whole Zen mode during the day. Just give it a try once and I think you'll experience some more calmness, especially when you're having deadlines or, well, I think we all have deadlines all of the time and have tons of emails waiting for us. And this will definitely help you with staying sort of calm during the hectic day. So after my short or a little bit longer meditation, I go to the kitchen and I grab some water. Drinking water will rehydrate your body and it will help with your digestion. So I think you will truly notice it during the day as well. And especially if you do it for a longer period of time. Of course, it's always necessary to drink enough water during the day, but just start your day with a full glass of water. It just gets the things flowing down there, you know? If you do this for a longer period of time, you will probably also notice the difference that you'll get a clearer skin as well. So the third thing that I do is take the time to make a healthy breakfast. And if you don't have a lot of time, you can of course also make healthy breakfasts just in the evening before you go to bed. For instance, make some overnight oats. You'll get a very nutritious breakfast as well. It's very easy to make and well, you're taking care of your body. But while I'm eating my healthy breakfast, I will write down what I'm grateful for. And I know this can sound a little bit fluffy or whatever, but especially during winter time, I really need this part because when I'm a little bit down, realizing what I'm grateful for really helps me to get to be more positive in life. You really have to make and create the time to do this. So for me, it really helps to, to get a notebook next to my breakfast, write down what I'm grateful for. Uh, sometimes I write a whole page. Sometimes I just write one thing. If I don't have the time, I usually do this in the shower and already think of it. Uh, because it will also make you realize what you have right now and maybe what you've worked for so long as well. You'll appreciate it way more. I think it truly helped me the past year to live in the now. So after I've had some breakfast, I always try to go outside, even if it's only for 10 seconds. I have a little balcony 
I just breathe in and breathe out and try to get some fresh air and it will really wake you up immediately as well. And it creates that feeling of being alive and breathing. So another habit is actually to move your body right away. For instance, when I have the time, I always try to do it once during my working week and also in the weekends, is just to have a short 15 minute workout. And I have a workout on YouTube that I personally really like. It's called Women's Workout Channel. And they have all these exercises to get a nice bubble butt or whatever. And you're already moving just before the working day starts because like me, for example, I'm sitting mostly the entire day and I don't like the feeling that I am having this life that I'm sitting all day. So that's why I wanna start the day off right. Now, of course, 15 minutes is quite long, but even some stretches or just getting out of bed and just like whatever, doing like this. Your body was in sleep mode, of course, probably the seven or eight hours before that. So you really have to shake up your body and just create the wake up mode. You can also just do a little dance. Shake up your body. <laughs> When it's time to do my makeup, I actually uh, do like a little affirmation and there is actually a postcard hanging on the mirror. Well, maybe I can just grab it. This is the card. It's in Dutch and it says, hey, beautiful human being. It's made by my sister actually. So I really, I, I just always like all of her work. Everybody who's looking at it just sees this. And I think that in itself already is an affirmation. If you don't have a card like this, it's, I think it's very helpful and it could be nice if you're just saying something like I feel great when I take good care of myself and just something like that just be nice to yourself so when I really have the time I also try to visualize in the morning and I've written down some of the things that I dream about that are my goals by now and I just close my eyes and think of what I want and I see myself doing it as well. And when I'm doing this very consciously, all of my dreams have come true in the past by doing this. So I can truly recommend you doing the same as well. Well, and basically after that, my working day usually starts. And um, I think all of this takes about an hour or so. And of course you really have to make and create the time. Once again, it's really a mindset, uh, set your alarm clock, so not on your phone, maybe the old school one, an hour before you usually wake up and just try it once. So of course, all of these habits sounds like a whole lot to do. And probably when you're having a lot of stress or well, you just don't want to make the time for it. You can also try to do the sort of reduced version of all of this. If you're curious how I do the reduced version, just let me know in the comments down below and I will try to make a video of that one as well. So I hope this video was helpful for you and that you're well getting a little bit more of a productive, happy and healthy day because of all of these nice habits. And I wanna thank you for watching and I hope to see you in the next video.